everyone, it's Fantasia and welcome to another episode of Modded Family. So look at this. I had to start right here because I was speeding up a little bit because as you guys can see, it's 5 a.m. So I didn't want to start the episode this early, but then this happened. So summer camps are where the fun happens when it's summertime and children want to get away, spend time with friends and make new ones and parents want to send their kids out for a while. Sign up today. And I think we're going to do it because this is a phone call that Atticus got and all this stuff that I feel like would be perfect for preteens is happening for him. He unexpectedly got braces. He like he's doing streaming, which I know preteens, but we said like, you know, we're just going to say that in the Sims, uh, you can stream when you're 12 and maybe there's like a special streaming platform for preteens. Who knows? Um, that's like more monitored and stuff. And then now this pops up. We're definitely going to have him sign up. I'm so excited. He's also not feeling that good. We need to do our notification shout out in a second, but there's just so much going on. Also, you guys, I need to start linking the mods again because for a while we, we were using the same mods, like every single episode. So I didn't link them for a while. Cause if you guys don't know, if you're a new viewer to the series, um, this has a season one and this is season two now and there was a lot of episodes where I would link the mods and we were using like the same basic ones like Cove um her mod like she's basically a cam girl and her career was linked in like so many episodes the base mental mod like I used to always put things in the description but we kept using like a bunch of the same ones wicked whims um, for the period stuff and all of that, the menstrual cycle and the attractiveness system, all of that fun stuff. And then the switch streaming, that mod, I've linked that a bunch of times, but now I feel like we're using, I mean, I may have linked them a couple times a long time ago, but not much. Like now, like he has the limp leg. You guys are asking about that. So this is from the healthcare redux mod. So I will link that. It's from exercise. Um, and then, oh, it's Sims world day. Oh, <gasps> I forgot about that. I'm going back to lurking. Love you, Atticus. Oh my God, he has fans already. I'm pretty sure he already got a donation too while I was speeding through. So hold on. Like he got that summer camp thing. So what happened with that? I don't know if anything even happened with that. Look, you guys. Okay, this is with the summer camp mod, if you guys are wondering. But like I said, I'm going to try to start linking the mods again because I do have some new mods. So we're probably going to be experiencing some things. I also got a new education system mod, which I just did a review on. So if you guys check my channel, you'll see it. Oh, this is with the education system mod. Yeah, school's out for the summer. Atticus will not need to return to school until the fall. Unless, however, his parents sent him back early. So he's just off. And it literally says on vacation. So it's only four days. And that's probably because did summer already begin? Because I feel like that's kind of short yeah, yeah yeah um but i just got the mod so you know but it's perfect because he stayed up all night and that's like so fitting because it's summer vacation and i feel like preteens that's such a classic thing to do <laughs> just stay up all night um when there's no school he oh oh you guys you guys you guys i'm pretty sure that i know he feels terrible i know i i know i'm sorry oh he's getting a phone call again what is it this time again i'll sign up right now how come it's not working I'm kind of confused what's happening. Like, are we supposed to tell him to sign up? Whoa, attend summer school. I haven't used this mod yet. Usually I'll like read about a mod and then do a review on it before I actually play with it in my game. But I haven't gotten to that yet. I haven't done a review on this mod yet. And so I don't know how to work it. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm supposed to go get a bikini wax. What's that from? This is from Wicked Whims if you're wondering. <laughs> Go, oh my god, wait. She should go get a bikini wax. I feel like she'd do both of these. We're gonna go get a bikini wax. Oh my god, you're so hungry. We have so much going on. We literally need to do our notification shout out, you guys. I promise I didn't forget. Everyone, oh, don't play in that. Everyone's just like eating fruit. You can't even grab that. But is there cake on here? Okay, eat the slice of cake. Oh, there's food. There's more here. Oh, you just feel like shit. I was about to say something at some point and then a bunch of stuff happened. So I got the medicine. Okay, here we go. Here is the medicine. So what had happened was in the last episode, the medicine wasn't popping up when I would like even shop at the pharmacy. It wasn't showing up no matter where I looked. And it's because I didn't download the medicine. So if you guys are having trouble, I actually have seen some comments before saying that like the medicine's not working for them. I've done a full review on this and I had the medicine. So that's how I was confused but I didn't realize that when I updated the mod, I forgot to also download the medicine because it's a separate download. So that's what had happened. But he just needs some like Advil or something, Tylenol. There's
there's ibuprofen. We could just get that because he's just in pain. Is there anything else that maybe we should just get just so we have it? Like she's, okay, so Cove is supposed to get prenatal vitamins. I don't know if she's actually pregnant. Oh, let's get some teen. Yeah, let's do that. I feel like we should have like multivitamins for everyone to be honest. Yeah, I feel like we definitely should. Okay, so let's get that stuff. And then what I'm gonna do is now he has everything. He's also filthy, so ignore that. <laughs> Just ignore it. Um, the youth vitamins, I'm just gonna give them. Actually, can you take them on your own? You can. Okay. So those are like for the young in, the the youngins. <laughs> um, and then the prenatals, I'm gonna give to her. And we still don't know for sure if she's pregnant, you guys. And then these ones, I should have got multiple for all of them. I really should have. Maybe I'll just like put it on one of the tables out here. But yeah, I should have got one for all of them oopsies okay anyways i'm gonna have him take this because i just feel like he really needs it and then also let's take a vitamin okay and then you're so stinky so it's sims world day that's basically like you know fourth of july canada day i just thought sims world day was perfect <laughs> Okay, so he just took his vitamins and the ibuprofen. So I'm gonna have him go ahead, go ahead and take a speedy shower because now you're super energized. Okay, so that does look like it helped a little bit. That's good. Here it is here. I just had to go check because like I said, I haven't done a mod review on this yet. Um, but now if you guys watch this Let's Play, the mod review will be pointless. <laughs> Although I will cover more in that. But anyways, so attend summer school and then attend summer camp. So there's two options here. Summer camps are available during the summer season. Camp lasts five days, Monday to Friday for day camps and Saturday to Sunday for away camps. Oh, signups are available from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. So he's going to be gone, essentially. I might do saturday to sunday for away camps because i still want to like do the preteen life with him but i do think he would go to summer camp so i am gonna have him do that just because like i mean yeah then he's gone on the weekends but oh no sorry totally just yep they didn't let you do that <laughs> like even though he'll be gone the whole weekend like i don't know i still just think it's better than him like leaving like i don't know i just want him here all day for the, in the weekdays and like it's summer vacation so we get even more time with him yeah we're gonna sign up okay so ooh. so there's a whole bunch of different options here like i said i will go through this more in my mod review for it um and we can experience like different ones perhaps but i think right off the bat sports camp absolutely Oh, he's excited for it. Oh my God, wait, this is so cool. It literally just takes away the school. Also, I'm thinking I'm gonna have him join a different school because with this mod, there's like different school types. So I think we're gonna do that. Oh, guys, we had put this storyline on the back burner because there's just a lot going on. And with a family this big, we kind of have to jump jump back and forth from storylines sometimes because there's just a lot going on. Oh my God, he just gained, he has 600 followers already. I feel like they do need to spend time together. So basically like just so much got in the way and a whole bunch went on. So things have just kept getting pushed back when it comes to them, but we do need to deal with it. Basically, let me open this up. They're not, we talked about this. They're, they're just not working anymore. They haven't seen each other. You know what? I think it's okay that this story was kind of like pu pushed aside for a not long just like a couple like not even long at all to be honest it just feels longer than it is i feel like but like harlow didn't see her on valentine's day i do think harlow actually is the type to just like leave things for a little bit you know she's processing things and then i think she's gonna go see her and break up with her so if you guys haven't been keeping up with it you know they worked so well together i think they were meant for each other at a certain time and sometimes Someone you're meant to be with at a certain time in your life is not your forever. And I think that was the situation here. Um, oh, I also need to talk about a situation with him on why he's still a toddler. So we'll talk about that in a minute. Yeah, I feel like uh, it's just they want different things now in life. They're not working anymore. She wants an open relationship, whereas Harlow wants a committed relationship. She's not comfortable with that. And it's just it's just a mess. Should we invite her out somewhere? She is really tired. I might put it up a little bit so we can deal with this. Okay, we're gonna go here. To me, it's the best place. <laughs> As for the toddler situation, so I did get a comment from one of you guys kind of feeling like Blaze should already be aged up and like feeling like Atticus and Blaze should have been kids at the same time. Obviously, Blaze is younger, but they technically would have been kids at the same time. 
until I found out there was the preteen mod. And then like, I just, I was so excited. And I was like, let's age him up to a preteen. And I don't feel like it's the biggest deal. He's going to be aging up. Like we're going to age him up super soon. We don't need to wait this whole time. Like he can literally age up tomorrow if we wanted. He can age up today. Like I know he's been a kid. I mean, a toddler for a little bit. Lifespan is on long. Um, but also I, Atticus and Blaze are further apart than I think a lot of you guys realize because I didn't even realize. Atticus was born on episode 31 of season one and then blaze was born in the finale literally the finale which was episode 60 so they're like 30 episodes apart that's a lot for sims time i think like i mean yes obviously the toddler phase is less age it's a lot less years compared to the time that you're a child but i think i think it's fine i honestly think it's fine because he was a kid for so so long and i wanted him to be a preteen and i feel like now blaze is going to be a child while he's a preteen which i think actually makes sense yes should blaze maybe have aged up like maybe a day before him yeah probably but <laughs> i was really excited about the preteen mod so i don't really feel like it's a big deal as long as blaze ages up soon i think it's completely fine also this is really weird do you see how they're like not into each other at all they're both on the phone like what also we need to do our notification shout out finally <laughs> We have a million things happening. So this one goes to totally amazing or wait, is it taught, taught, taught heli amazing or I don't know if I'm saying this right because it's spelled different. <laughs> when I first saw it, I thought it was totally amazing, but no, it's not. Um, thank you so much. I'm so glad that you're obsessed with the storyline. That makes me happy. Um, I hope you continue to enjoy and thank you for your comments. So if you guys want to chance me in a notification shout out, all you gotta do is comment down below. I'm literally trying like, hello, you guys just separated. Oh my gosh. She's literally playing the piano. <laughs> oh my god okay wait she wants to go to the bathroom and i think i'm just gonna let her okay so honestly we're gonna get right to it i feel kind of bad but oh no wait it's not even in here it's in mean we're just gonna break up. i wish it wasn't in mean i wish there was like a nice way to break up Ooh, you okay sure that might not be like a romantic thing oh my god she's literally breaking up for her with her from so far are you kidding me what is this what do you mean? You better apologize to her for breaking up to breaking up with her like that. Oh my god. I thought they would at least get up. Oh my goodness. Wait, stop. Talk with each other over here, please. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, I'm gonna Harlow's the type where I feel like she doesn't want to be enemies with anyone. So we're gonna try to beg for forgiveness and let's see. I don't know. Oh my gosh, you just want to go on the piano. You like, you literally don't care. It looks like she's fine. It looks like everything's okay, maybe? I don't know. I want them to get out of here and just see if they can actually handle talking with each other. To actually see if they can like, you know, be friends. Cause I mean, some people can break up and still be friends. Like you never know. She looks upset, but let's just see. Cause I do feel like this would be a healthy breakup. Let's have a, let's just, uh, yeah, let's have a deep conversation about it. Maybe she can try to hug her or something. I do want to leave things on a good note. You know, I don't want them to hate each other. Oh, they had a minus sign. Can they even hug right now? I don't know. Oh, they can. Okay, let's see if she'll accept it. Let's see. Will you hug her? Oh my gosh, she won't hug her. Oh no. Okay, so she seems pretty upset. She keeps talking to her really sad, but hopefully, hopefully they will be friends. I mean, I hope so. But for now, I think she's gonna, you know, head back home. And the breakup has officially happened, you guys. Oh my god. Okay, so, I mean, I think she'll be okay today because there's just a poop over here. Love that. <laughs> I think she'll be okay because it is Sims World Day. They're gonna start celebrating soon. Um, That might be more towards the next episode, though, because we have other things to do. Like, um, oh, he's feeling better. His leg is feeling a lot better. Like, he is hungry. He's so hungry. A little off. She still has the a little off, you guys. I want to see if anything happens if she, oh, she can't take it right now. Okay. So, what do you guys think? uh this might not be like a false pregnancy like it might actually be happening the reason she might not be able to take a pregnancy test could be because she technically already knows because there's a lot of mods that um that was the healthcare redux mod I, she's like literally trying to swim like crazy i feel like she is having to pee faster so i don't know i guess we'll find out like she really 
she might be you guys comment down below if you think she's actually pregnant or not i really wanted to find out in this episode i'm not sure if that's gonna happen it might take a little bit but i kind of like the idea of this like if she really is pregnant i'm not spoiling for myself i, I want to be surprised if she really is <laughs> so oh god oh no Ugh. um so he has started streaming and one of you guys did suggest that it could be like his little job and i know he's young but it could be cool. Like, you know, The Sims, we could do whatever the heck we want. And I think, you know, we can kind of go with this storyline where there's like a streaming platform for people who are, young, who are younger and it's like a way for preteens to make some money. I mean, we're going to be leaving soon. So I guess like while we have a little bit of time, it literally is saying it's out of range again. I don't know why this keeps happening. Turn on the router. He Is he cooking? He's making a garden salad. Look at him go. He's trying to start learning how to cook. He's a preteen now. <laughs> Oh my gosh. And everyone's literally watching him. We have a show going on. The preteen is making some salad. Everyone needs to watch. That's so funny. Oh my god, he's talking to the kitty. That's so precious. But yeah, you guys, we can literally age up Blaze in the next episode. Like, we can do it anytime soon. But yeah, we're gonna have to go out and celebrate. It's five now, so I feel like we should do that. Now you want to go out with her, but I'm sorry. <laughs> We're gonna go somewhere else. Tell me why. I just want to go here and we can be at the beach and there's a big fire there. Okay, you guys. So we're here and I, while the loading screen was going, I'm having like all these ideas. I'm so inspired with, oh, Atticus likes fitness. Yes. I'm so inspired with the series lately. There's just so much changes going on. And so first thing I want to do is I think, oh, she's upset, but I'm not saying anything's gonna happen because she literally just broke up with her. However, she has been disconnected for a while now and she's been wanting to break up with her for a while but we are going to invite her here i don't know if anything will happen um we're gonna have a lot of fun here we're gonna just we're just gonna have a fun time we're gonna have a fire and then i was like wait should i have like made a cake and just had Blaze's birthday be Sims World Day. I think it would be cute. What do you guys think? Because I would have done it like in the next episode anyways, but I would have waited till like the next day. Cause I'm gonna resume in the next episode when it's still Sims World Day. I was gonna age him up later in the episode when it's already the next day. Cause we'll definitely play into the next day in the next episode. But now I'm like, should he age up here? Like this would be cute if he ages up here. That would be really cute. I might do that. So what do you guys think? Oh my god. It could be cute. And then he could do more for Sims World Day. He could do some like sparklers and stuff. That would be cute. But you guys, I'm going to wrap up this episode here and I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you guys are all having an amazing, amazing day. And don't forget to leave some positivity down below. I love you guys all so, so much and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. The